हेलो गाइस माई सेल्फ अमृता वेलकम बैक टू आर चैनल टेक्नोसेज सो टूडेज टॉपिक इज माई एस क्यू एल नल वैल्यूज लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड अ फील्ड विद नल वैल्यू मीन्स देर इज नो वैल्यू लेट्स टेक अ रियल टाइम एग्जाम्पल लेट्स से यू हैव अ टेबल कॉल्ड एम्प्लॉयज विद एम्प्लॉई आई डी एम्प्लॉई नेम सिटी कंट्री सपोज अ न्यू एम्प्लॉय हैज जॉइंड इन द ऑर्गेनाइजेशन एंड यू आर अपडेटिंग हिज डेटा यू नो हिज name his id his country but you don't know which city he belongs to so you have updated all other fields except city so automatically that city field will be updated with null value that means empty value let's say after some time you want to update the empty values if there are any for any employees so you can test using is null operator there are two types of operator one is is null and one is is not null is null means you want to test the empty values null values and you want to update those and is not null is for non empty values that means which already has values you just want to check whether there are any fields with non empty values so let's understand the syntax first and then we'll try to execute the queries so the first one is is null simply you need to write your select statement that means select column 1 column 2 from टेबल नेम एंड देन यू नीड टू पुट योर कंडीशन एंड हेयर इन दिस केस वॉट इज आर कंडीशन वेयर दैट पर्टिकुलर कॉलम एनी कॉलम इज नल दैट मीन्स दैट पर्टिकुलर कॉलम इज एम टी एंड यू वॉन्ट टू नाउ अपडेट द वैल्यू ऑफ दैट एंड अनदर वन इज इज नॉट नल सो इन दैट केस जस्ट इंस्टेड ऑफ दिस इज नल यू कैन से इज not null it is as simple as that so let's run the query in our table so you can see here we have a table called employees having employee name employee id address and city and here you can see that for this employee called mary doesn't have employee id and employee address that means these two fields are null so if we are checking the condition where employee id is null or where address is null it will fetch the result of this particular employee and if we are checking for is not null that means for the fields which are not null then all other fields should be retrieved so our query would be select star from company dot employees that means employees table from company database where employee id is null now if we run this query we should get the result of this employee whose employee id is null so let's run the query so you can see here right our result set is the data of the employee whose employee id is null even if we check here where address is null again the address is null for only this particular employee so we should again get the same result so you can see here right same result is returned so let's write another query where particular details are not null select star from company dot employees where employee id is not null right so now except mary we should get details of all other employees details because employee id is not null for all those employees so let's run the query and see the output so you can see here right details of all the employees are returned except mary so in real time you can use these operators in case if you want to update the empty details and you want to check if there are any empty details for any particular employee i hope you understood the solution if you have any doubts or any comments please let me know in the comment section and don't forget to like share and subscribe our channel and also press the bell icon for more updates stay tuned